four basic operating parameters in a rack during harvest to provide automatic control of the floating crop dividers and contour base cutter height. The floating crop divider pressure adjustment sets the hydraulic pressure in the crop divider lift system necessary to control the contact pressure between the crop dividers and the soil surface. Setting the pressure higher transfers more crop divider weight to the machine, reducing the ground contact pressure. Setting the pressure lower transfers less crop divider weight to the machine, increasing the ground contact pressure. Crop divider pressure is displayed numerically with a representative value between 100 and 0 to indicate the degree of hydraulic float selected to maintain crop divider ground contact without digging or pushing crop material. The crop divider pressure may require adjustment as soil surface and debris conditions vary or set base cutter height is changed during operation. Observing full divider movement and correct ground contact throughout the entire pressure range from 0 to 100 indicates the crop dividers can float through their entire mechanical range. Crop divider position values can be observed by the operator by populating the two right editable cells on the first sugar screen or the upper two editable cells on the second sugar screen with divider position values. The base cutter height is the vertical position of the base cutter when in operation. The base cutter target height is influenced by the crop divider position while operating. If the soil surface rises and the crop dividers move upward, the system anticipates a need to raise the base cutter. If the crop dividers move into a depression and lower, the base cutter may react to the crop divider movement by lowering. Base cutter pressure is the hydraulic drive pressure required by the base cutter drive motors. The base cutter height is ultimately controlled to maintain the target height by monitoring the base cutter pressure. If the base cutter makes heavier contact with the soil, an increase in base cutter pressure will result and the system will raise the base cutter to reduce dirt in the cane and damage to the stubble. The base cutter target pressure is the setting for normal harvest conditions. However, if field conditions or contour change, the degree of base cutter contact with the soil may vary. The base cutter override pressure is the difference between normal harvest pressure and an elevated pressure value that would indicate ground contact and a need to raise the base cutter. Correct system setup and adjustment is necessary for the electronically controlled system to perform at its greatest efficiency and accuracy. These steps will be demonstrated in full detail.